Cyberspace has changed the day-to-day -day lives of people in a myriad of ways. Not only has it created opportunities for individuals, businesses, and governments to flourish, but for cyber criminals as well. The National Science Foundation, NSF, co-sponsored by the Department of Homeland Security, DHS, recognized the need to develop a strong education system and workforce in cybersecurity to keep up with rapid advancement of technology. NSF began offering a grant-funded scholarship to those interested in pursuing a career in a cybersecurity-related field. It's been a great stepping stone. Um, it got me my full-time job after this. It's really exciting. You're going into this computer science program. You're with students that have traveled across the world. You're with all these military professionals. Have a totally different background than you have. But we all come here and we kind of have the same goal. We want to graduate here. We go to a job fair twice a year in Washington, D.C. And so we are able to interact and connect with other scholarship for service students uh, all around the country. NSF began offering a grant-funded scholarship to those interested in pursuing a career in a cybersecurity-related field. And the Naval Postgraduate School is one of the 62 schools nationwide that offers the program. The Scholarship for Service program, SFS, pays full tuition, books, and a stipend to attend MPS for two or three years for a student finishing a bachelor's degree and transitioning to a graduate program prior to graduation. There is no other program like this. If I tried to do it anyplace else, it would have been like a year plus of um, undergrad requirements. Yeah, so I really appreciate this opportunity. In addition, um, getting paid for your master's degree is absolutely an invaluable experience. When I graduated with my undergrad, I just, it was all like, you know, wide open, like what I didn't know what I wanted to do, and so it helped me specify what exactly I feel I was going to go into in the computer science. Selected students will have a service obligation to work for a government agency equal to the length of the scholarship. MPS also offers a program called Monarch, geared for students that do not have a major in the cybersecurity field. Students are offered classes in the computer science field to bring them up to speed in respect to undergraduate prerequisites. I believe it's the only master's program where you cannot have your bachelor's in computer science and just jump into the master's. The cyber field is really growing and especially in government trying to being able to protect the information of the government is really important today and so being in this field is a great opportunity. If we can serve our country that that is very useful at this, at this point in time because yeah. it's a really unique skill to have so it's, it's, it's a skill not many people have. It's, yeah, it's yeah. a skill that not people have. So cybersecurity it goes anything from protecting your parents to protecting your country. The SFS and Monarch program not only educates the United States' future cybersecurity experts, but also invests in students willing to make a change for the better.